Hello, my lovely Scorpio. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Scorpio, today will do your bonus reading for the month of January. Sun, Moon, Rising Signs and Venus Signs. For many of you, Scorpios, the first reading I'm posted, I posted here on the channel might resonate highly. For many others of you, this is the one you might resonate. Let's see, loves, what we have in the energies for you and for this bonus energy and how this will benefit, bless you in the predictions. Let's see, Scorpio, what we have here for you. And I will choose a random card here. Joy and delight. Open your heart to joy. There's a very beautiful energy around the Scorpios at this time. But also it's kind of like redirecting the energy into the good might see a very good energy as well. And in the flow, everything is smooth sailing. It's kind of going with the flow, whatever it is. And opening to receive the things, that's the beauty. Good job, Scorpios, because I feel here there is a Scorpio here who manifests just good things. It's like I am focused only on the positive, which that is very, very much and very good to all, all of you Scorpios. But let's see here what the Spirit brings to you at this time and how the energy flows there for you overall energy for this time we have the emperor and underneath we have three of swords there is something here you you feel like like i'm need i in in need of taking action. I'm not sure why my voice is acting up today. It's not like I'm sick or anything, but it's it's something here. Probably we're going into a Korean season and that's very much about air energy. Whatever speaks clarity here. And I feel here there is a lot of shifting energies. But what I'm seeing here for you, loves, you might deal here with an Aries, doesn't need to be. But there is a decision here to make. Let's see here what this is about. Virgo energy, Hermit energy, deep reflection, Seven of Wands, Ten of Cups, Queen of Swords, Ace of Swords, Page of Cups, Six of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, and Two of Cups. Uh, I'm trying today to do quite a little different, the energies, since they are so much back and forth. Somebody here, loves, needs to decide and to be very clear with what they want. I see Aries, I see Virgo, I see Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and I do see your energy as well, Scorpio. But I'm feeling here, there is somebody here who needs to let go something. And it's kind of like, I need to choose. You're very connected here with somebody. Could be slightly older or slightly younger than you are. But let's see. What's the resistance here for? Seven of Wands, Ten of Swords to let go something here behind. And that could be a fire sign here. Aries energy again. Wheel of Fortune. It's time to let it go something. Overcoming whatever it needs to, those obstacles. And whatever is here, whatever you let it go, the universe is telling you it's time. 
and the universe is helping you to go through it. Six of Pentacles here. Star, Aquarius energy. Eight of Wands. Choosing what you want, what you deserve, what you want to go towards. And Ace of Wands. And underneath we have the Sun. New things, new energy. For some of you, yes. You are the one who need to leave behind somebody. Somebody who might not really speak to you. Somebody who is kind of like my way or no way. Whatever it is. But there is something new, Scorpio, for you. Why you were in doubt here? I don't know if I, I can do this. Somebody here was like, I was not sure if I can do it. And that's your confirmation. And yes, you can do it. Because I feel here there, there was a fear behind all this. It's hard for me to get through this. Or if I will go towards somebody new, that will work or not. I feel here as you take your time, yes, there is here. And there is a strong connection here. Queen of Swords, speak to me. Four of Pentacles, Page of Wands, Five of Pentacles, and Ten of Pentacles. Underneath we have Ace of Cups. This person seems that they love you very much. And it's somebody here who holds on you. But the fact is there is somebody else in the picture. A fire sign. So, what I'm feeling here, they, they will speak to you again, but as well, they will tell you how much they love you and what they want with you. How about you, Scorpio? Because somebody here seems to me that they are in some sort of commitment or they've been in a commitment with somebody else. Page of Cups, Three of Wands, Empress, Six of Wands, Chariot, Two of Wands, yes. Somebody here choose to move on from a life partner. And it's kind of like, I choose to move on from them. I detached from them. And I'm moving forward. Beautiful cards here of movement forward for you, Scorpio. And that's the joy and delight. Open your heart for new things. But indeed here, there's a Scorpio who moves forward from somebody. And that somebody might be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or a Sag. And now it's new love. Let's see here what, what is all the outcome for this. What's the outcome for this? Eight of Swords. King of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles and Knight of Swords. There's a lot of things here you, you need to clear. Also, there's a lot of responsibilities you might need to take care of. Could be financial responsibilities. But I feel here, whatever is here, even you never thought you can go 
towards this person. I feel here this person, indeed, they are ready for you. As we see the other cards as well. It's like you, you might tell them, well, I'm coming forward, I'm moving forward, I make my mind, but I still have to deal with some stuff. There might be some talk with this person. But I feel here it's kind of like grounding yourself. It's something here about finances, which might, might be a little fear. I cannot make it financially or I need to contribute something here financially. But indeed here there is a detachment. Also, this person still waits for you. They want to be around you. All right, loves. All right, that's why it's kind of like, take it easy, go with the flow, and know that there are miracles over there. Take your time, whatever you're going, because I feel here, you're moving in the right direction. All right. All righty. Scorpio, that's what I have for you at this time. Love and light. And of course, we'll see you next time. Namaste.